Well, he was, was, was very impressive, very strong. What a body, huh? Okay, Wander Braga against Yoni. So we got Braga against Yoni. Jiu Jitsu against Luta Livre. These All are right. the two biggest rivals in this game. Both grapplers, the Luta Livre guy with the blue, with the black shorts and with the blue stripes. All right, well, Rio de Janeiro, the hometown of both of these young men. That should be a very good fight. Yep. Jiu Jitsu makes good with us to bring the fight to the ground. The little liver guy fights not to go, not to go under and from the bottom. Look at, look at Wonder use the ring to his advantage. He's trying a few knees. You're right. He wants to stay up. The worst feeling in the world is to be a uh, a stand-up fighter fighting on your back. That's tough. Well, I'll tell you what, though. Yoni is uh, using some uh, great strength there to keep his opponent pinned against the rope. Comes up with a left hand. Another left, another left. Again, we are in Sao Paulo, Brazil, bringing you phenomenal Valley Tudo fighting. This is a great tournament. Non-stop action. Always. This is what I love about this. And, and I like the way the fans around here get into this. They are uh, among the most rabid fans I've ever seen, I guess is the easy way to put it. They love their fighting. They love their Valley Tudo. 9,000 people here. One thing that scares me about the Brazilian uh, crowd is that the fights won't happen in the ring and <laughs> outside of the ring. Sometimes they do. You get a little carried away. I've uh, been intimidated a time or two myself sitting near ringside. All right. Nice move there by Yoni. Yoni is... Uh, uh, Johnny is def definitely the aggressive, which you should come in on top fighting with the, bl with the black shot. Seems the Luta Libre guy is, is on fighting from the bottom is a little bit worried about the, the Jiu Jitsu. Uh, he's flailing away, but not really doing any damage. He tried a couple of elbows to the head, but the wonder is, uh, I think he's in a very compromising position being down low as he tries to avoid a couple of strikes, and he does nice, good work with his hands, although takes a couple of headbutts to the right side of his face. Yoni on top. The little little guy is using the right guard by using his knees to hold back the Jiu Jitsu guy. The Jiu Jitsu guy just striking with lefts and rights. Devastating blows. Yoni on top. Look at the body fat on those guys. Oh, there's none. <laughs> These guys are cut. They work out all the time. Those were effective left hands because it brought the guard down of Wonder, who, who just got his hand down and took a couple of more shots to the face. By the man on top. You get your Luca Livre guy trying to put his foot on the on the hips, trying to bring the opponent back. That's a nice control uh, position to be in if you can do it. A couple of elbows to the back of the head. Another headbutt from Yoni though. Watch this. I can see another headbutt coming here. <laughs> so could he. Again, no gouging of the eyes, but uh, they had long enough hair. I guess you could pull it, right? Oh yeah. Well, he's trying to put the, uh, the hands in. Wonder is trying to just ward off some of those, uh, that, that massive attack from the man on top who, who looks a lot thicker, you know, physically, muscularly. He's a bigger man, it looks like, although they both weigh about the same. The is definitely the aggressor. Nice headbutt. If there is such a thing as a nice headbutt. Oh, left and a right and a headbutt. That's an unusual combination, ladies and gentlemen. A left, a right, and a headbutt. Now here comes a bunch of right hands as Yoni tries to get Wonder to bring that guard down, bring his hands down so he can headbutt as he softens up the side of his opponent with those shots to the ribs. Boy, they just, you take so many of them, you get bruised there, you get very sore, and it's just tough to go on. Jiu-Jitsu against Luta Livre, a classic. Both men now seem to be taking a little bit of a break here. Gary, these guys have been fighting for over 50 years. These two styles are the responsible for the growth of ground fighting in Brazil. Well, nobody does it better than the Brazilians, I'll tell you. They uh, continue to produce great Valley Tudo fighters. Now the Jiu-Jitsu man achieves the mountain as the little little man turns his back. Okay, he's trying to, he's, there he's going for the he choke. That's and it. that's it. Jiu -jitsu. Boy, he just, he, boy, he locked that thing in there. Jiu-Jitsu. Advances to the court to the semifinals. Man, I'll tell you, 
And he'll fight Ailton, the full contact guy. It'll be a very good fight. All right, boy, just continue to pummel him with blows. And finally, when he locks that in, he's really got a beautiful choke hold. And he chokes out his opponent before he lost consciousness. All right, let's go to our next fight. We have not had a dull one yet, ladies and gentlemen.